What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you've never seen my face before, my name is Caitlin and I am back with another fashion haul for you guys. This one is a little bit more autumn vibes, a little bit more trendy, seasonal. Um, I'm really excited to show you this. So it is obviously, as you can see from the title, a cotton on haul. I'm so excited. I'm obsessed with everything that I've got. I've been wearing all of it constantly already. I think you guys are gonna really, really, really love what I'm gonna show you. And y'all, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Kate Harty and follow me on TikTok at Caitlin Harty because that's where I style all of these pieces, make cute little videos, cute little stories, cute little reels. So definitely go and check me out over there and make sure to follow me and like this video if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate the support. It really helps me out. And yeah, let's just get straight into the haul. So before I get into the haul, obviously, what am I wearing? So this sweater is from Cotton On last year pretty much exactly this time so i just think it's like so full circle how literally last year this time i was filming like lockdown vlogs and lockdown hauls and stuff like that's where i really like just started creating content really and cotton on was just like my absolute go-to like their sweat sets and stuff like this went absolutely viral I bought a couple of them and everyone was like flooding my DMs, what size, this, where can I get this, it's not online, like it's sold out online over and over and over again. It was just, it was insane and it's just like that time of year again where we're looking for comfy sweats again because it's going into winter. So that's why I'm excited to bring you guys this haul. So this was one of the sweaters that I bought last year but this is just the classic crew that Cotton On does in so many different colors. So this is still available, just not in this color. I have this in gray well i'm wearing the gray i'm wearing the gray pants but i have the matching top to that gray i've got the matching white pants i've got the mint in this i've got the gray in this like they are so comfortable and as you can see it's lasted me a full year and it's not normal because i wore them constantly this is the only things these are the only pieces of clothing that i wore during lockdown last year when it was like really serious we couldn't leave our houses and it was cold. I just felt like throwing this guy on again because I felt like full circle. It's a little like sentimental, like these cotton on sweaters and stuff really got me through lockdown last year because I still felt like cute and I was still taking photos and creating content for you guys, but in my comfy warm clothes. So I thought I'd pop it on today. This little butterfly necklace and the matching butterfly earrings is from Mr. Price. They were like 36 round, it was so amazing. If I keep going like this, it's because I'm wearing lip gloss and my fringe keeps touching my lips which might get a little bit annoying <laughs> anyways my little beaded necklace and beaded bracelet is from a local brand that i spoke about in my vlog last week and yeah like i said i'm wearing the matching pants as well so yeah let's get into some nice trendy pieces from cotton on so the first pieces i'm going to share with you guys are accessories i'm going to get the accessories out of the way and then we're going to go into the cool pieces of clothing so i picked up these two peaks from cotton on if you don't know already i love to style outfits with hats like this i find it just super like street style casual comfortable um i think it can make an outfit look really cool so i picked up two different colors obviously a black and this is it looks white but it is like a cream color a really nice warm cream color i can wear these for exercise if i want i wear them like if i go for a run or if i'm going for a walk or something like that because as I just mentioned I do have bangs so I do need something to keep my hair out of my face but I mainly got them because they're really trendy they're also completely blank which I like I'm not so sh unless I have like a Nike tick I don't really want anything um, on my hat because it makes it a lot more versatile and yeah, I love wearing hats when I'm running errands or when my hair is dirty so if you didn't watch my long hair chats um, on my vlogs a couple weeks ago I spoke about how oh, and it's to, like leaning towards the end of the day so if the light goes in and out that's why but I spoke about how I get my hair like long and healthy and whatever and I spoke about how girls kind of either wash their hair too much or they don't wash their hair enough and use a lot of dry shampoo so if for example tomorrow not my hair wash day but my hair's a little bit greasy i'm not going to put dry shampoo in it unless i absolutely need to i'm just going to throw a peak on and it makes you look cool makes you look trendy stylish put together and then it hides your greasy hair if you don't want to put it in like a slick bun so highly recommend these they come in so many different colors my friend lauren has such cute ones with like a little daisy on 
Um, I love them. Me and my other friend Courtney were also speaking about them. This one comes in like a road tripper. It has that um, on the front and I just think they are really, really, really cool. And obviously two staple colors, a light color and a dark color. They're gonna go with a lot of your outfits. Also in winter, like you know, when you're wearing oversized blazers and stuff like that, just throwing on a peak with some sunglasses, amazing. Also, they do help me a little bit, like you become so like incognito if you're wearing a hat, a mask and sunglasses incognito like you don't have to worry about anyone approaching you like it's just a dream it really is just a dream i'm definitely definitely into peaks into hats and yeah they're obviously functional as well oh i spoke a lot about hats there didn't i i feel like it's something i'm quite passionate about <laughs> anyway let's move on so the other two things are not special at all i'm just gonna throw them in here so you guys get to a cotton on but they really do have such nice masks this is one of my favorite masks to wear um, I think the print, like the checkered print, so nice. They have this in like purple, they have plain black ones, all that kind of stuff. And the wire is really, really flexible and they're adjustable straps. So I just thought I'd mention that they're like, I think, 80 round with your purchase. And then if you do ever forget your bag, pick up one of these little tote bags from them. How cute is this one? Like, I just love this so much. I would have bought this even like if I brought my own bag. Um, I just think it's so so cute little tote bags are so handy to have and I use this for like my shopping and all that kind of stuff Just so that I'm not carrying around like my gross like those Woolworths bags like I'm not into that So I'll carry this around put my groceries in it and it's still really 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 cute Okay now into the juicy stuff. I'm gonna start with these pants. Um, every time I post about them on my Instagram, y'all go insane and ask me where they're from the whole time. So they are these ribbed, filet legged. They're like quite legging-ish. They have that like really stretchy ribbed material. Um, they are, like I said, filet legged, so they really go out at the bottom. They are really cool, very high-waisted. So I got these in a size small. You can definitely size down with these, I think, because they're always gonna be um, long enough, but you can get away with going smaller because they are a very figure-hugging um, pair of pants. So I wouldn't, I personally wouldn't upsize because maybe it's not gonna fit you. It'll probably still fit you in your waist, but it might like get a little bit looser around your thighs, but yeah, a small fits me perfectly and I'm normally like a size 34 in pants or in jeans at least. I love these. I picked them up specifically in this color because I felt like this color was the most versatile. I felt like I could wear this in summer as well and also in winter and layer it with different kind of textures and stuff. Yeah, I love them. I seriously wear these a lot. I mainly been styling them with tiny little crop tops and like oversized shirts and my sneakers or just like a huge oversized shirt. I think it looks really, really cool. I would highly, highly recommend these. They come in so many different colors, um, but this is the one that I decided to get. They also make these pants in like more like pajama fabric. But what I like most about these, and I've spoken about this before when I make hauls, but I find that whenever there's like a flare to a pair of pants, they are normally so much shorter. And I'm only like 170 centimeters, 171 centimeters maybe. Um, and I always find that pants are like hitting me awkwardly on the ankles. Like I want them to be long. That's when they're the most flattering. When they're long, they like hit your sneaker, they hit the floor. That's when you look more like elongated, tall. It's very, very, very flattering. So that's why I love these so much. I will not wear a pair of pants that are flare leg that like only hit my ankle. Ugh, can't do that. Highly recommend these. The second color I probably would have picked up is the black, but I own a very similar pair of black pants. But yeah, I would recommend this like light nude kind of color and then the black. Oh, I have another accessory to show you, but I thought I'd show you this with the next outfit because I actually bought them together specifically because I wanted to style them together. But there is this brown leather, vegan leather um, shoulder bag. This is so cute. I am absolutely in love with this. So it's obviously very like patent leather. It's very shiny, um, but there is a light in front of you. That's what's kind of catching on it. But such a versat versatile color. So, so cute. The strap's also adjustable. So I think I'm going to shorten mine a little bit. I have worn this a couple of times already. There's even like stuff inside it, but I haven't taken this flipping thing off. That is one thing that can sometimes get a little bit annoying about, about cotton on is their labels and they tags and stuff inside. They're so long and aggressive, very versatile. All year round, I will be wearing this bag. Obviously it's really tiny, but you guys know I love a tiny bag. I only need my phone and my credit card and a lip gloss 
that's it. So that doesn't bother me at all. And obviously this is the color of 2021. Everyone wants something in like nice chocolate brown colors and this is just so, so cute. How I've been styling this is with the set that I'm about to show you that I know you guys are gonna love so much. And also with those split pants, a chocolate brown little crop top and an oversized white collared shirt. Um, I definitely love styling this bag. And it's definitely big enough to fit everything that you need in. Like you can fit all your keys, your phone, your lip gloss, whatever in here. So highly, highly recommend. This one also comes in black and I think like a dark green. But just check online because there's different types. This is one with no texture. There's other ones that have like crux skin sort of textures on them. But yeah, I absolutely love this. So. The next set I am obsessed with, again, it's in this chocolate brown kind of color. You can already see, you don't even know what it is, but you can see it's soft, it's cozy, it's comfy. It's just, I'm gonna be living in this this winter. So, it is a chocolate brown sweat set, and it's very similar to the top that I'm wearing now, but this one actually has a print on. Now, sometimes I'm a little bit reluctant to buy sweaters and comfy clothes with prints on because I prefer to like layer these or like just have them a little bit more simple. But I just love the kind of varsity prep college vibe that Factory and Cotton On are doing so, so well right now. Like I'm just obsessed with it. So because it gave me like a college varsity vibe, I got it. So this is the top. This is the top. It says St. Moritz on it. Um, sports club, St. Moritz sports club on it. They've got a lot of sports club and tennis club stuff. So this, I think they're both from factory and not cotton on. Yeah, they are both from factory. So yeah, I just love it so much. I got the sweater in a size medium. This one's also a medium. I just find that the mediums fit me really, really, really well. They're oversized, but not like exceptionally baggy. You can still kind of hike them up and they'll sit like in your waist, but when you pull them down, it's gonna be quite long like you can't wear it as a dress but it's still oversized um so i stuck to that size and i got a medium absolutely love it it's so nice again so soft on the inside it's pretty much exactly the same as this but just a little bit more refined a little bit more stylish more trendy and yeah more 2021 i just think it's so so cool and this color is just everything like i understand why everyone's obsessed with it i'm obsessed with it <laughs> it's amazing and then i got the matching pants so this is the only thing that i'm having a little bit of a problem with all of my sweatpants from um, factory and cotton on that i've been speaking about i've also gotten a size medium i would normally get a small or an extra small in like leggings and stuff like that from cotton on but the sweatpants you want them to be a bit more oversized a little bit more baggy more comfortable lounge bearish so I get all my sweatpants in a medium and I love, love the fit of the medium and I recommended it to all of you last year. But I think they might have changed their sizing a little bit or their style or their style of cut, I'm not sure. Cause this is still, or oh, I don't know if this is the exact same pair of sweatpants. This is the classic fit sweatpants and I'm not sure if it's a, if it's a different style but it feels like the exact same style but this medium is not as baggy and as loose and oversized as I would want it so I'm gonna see if I can exchange these for a large but this is what they look like really cool it literally the exact same colors the tops so they go together perfectly um they do fit they're comfortable they feel great in I just prefer to be a little bit more like drowning in my sweaters in my sweatsuits so i think i'm gonna try and get this in a large if i can't like i said it's completely fine but i just hate it when like pants like even touch my thighs like comfy pants like this like just don't just get away from me i want to be able to like roll it over and like really be comfortable and warm um so yeah keep in mind when you do get the classic fit i got a medium and i would much rather get a large but i mean if you don't want it to be super oversized then you know do what you want but if you guys have been here since lockdown last year i did a huge um cotton on haul and a lockdown haul and all of those sweatpants were in a medium and i loved the way that they fit so yeah that's it love this set so just picture in your head i've got my beige cap on my full chocolate brown sweat set my sneakers and my little chocolate brown handbag. Like that is just it, some black sunglasses, even the black hat, like 
that is it a claw clip in my hair that is my winter outfit Okay, so the second last thing I'm going to show you guys, I've been really into this trend at the moment, or this style at the moment, um, because I do like to wear, you guys have seen before, I like to wear itty bitty crop tops, and I love a good pair of like baggy jeans, so sometimes I want to like balance out my proportions, so I throw on a collared oversized shirt on top, it's almost like a men's shirt trend, um, like you're wearing your husband's shirt, or your boyfriend's shirt, whatever, I think it's really cool, I think it's really sexy, and really stylish so I have a couple I've got a striped blue and white one that looks like very boyfriendish and then I have like a white colored one so I want something like a little bit more girly a little bit more Caitlin a little bit more youthful so I picked this one up so it is a, a pink pinstriped oversized collared shirt I got this in a size large like I said I wanted to be really oversized so you can wear this like as a dress as well um, but like I said earlier, I like to style it with like little crop tops or even little bralettes. Cotton on body actually has these really nice straight bralettes and they just look so good when you're trying to like layer pieces like this. You can wear a blazer on top of it. Um, it's just really nice. You can just tie it over your shoulders. You can tie it over your waist. It's a nice thing to bring along. Um, if you feel like you're gonna get cold, you can fold your sleeves up, you can leave them down. Um, so yeah, I actually wore this today, that's why it was hanging over here. And how I styled it is just with a really tight little white crop top over here. I had my pink kind of beaded jewelry, high-waisted jeans, sneakers, and a white shoulder bag, and my hair was loose. So that's definitely how I would continue to style these things. They're really, really, really good to have. Um, the other night, I have a very similar one like this, and I just tied it up and you look so put together. They're such a stylish piece of fashion to have in your wardrobe. So I'd highly recommend going to pick one of these up. They have these in a whole bunch of different colors, but I did like the pink the most. But the second color that I liked the most, it was like a minty kind of green color. I actually might get that. I might go get it. <laughs> I also like having these in my wardrobe because I feel like I can be true to my own style. So if I am wearing like a little crop top and I want to be like a little bit more appropriate, you're going to a family luncheon or something, these are really nice to just throw over your shoulders. And adding that extra layer, that extra texture, um, it makes you look so much more stylish, so much more put together and it's so much more expensive. So I'd highly recommend picking up these. Love it. So I only have one more thing to show you, but I've saved it for last because it is just everything. I It is my holy grail right now. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. Basically, mini story time. I promise I'll only take 30 seconds to tell the story time. But if you guys are from Cape Town, you know that we had some fires really near to my apartment and we actually had to evacuate. And um, I had to take like some of my like important things, obviously, and just put it in the car. Obviously, everything's fine and we're so grateful. But you don't know what you're gonna take until you're in that situation. And I took this. Like obviously I took my tech and like my passport and stuff like that. And I was like, I need some clothes. And this was literally one of the things that I bought. The other thing that I bought was this handbag just because I hadn't worn it yet. And I literally put it in the car. But this is, it's just everything. It is a vegan leather black blazer. I'm obsessed with her. I love her so, so much. So I got I got this in a size 14 AU. I got it oversized. I don't really understand these sizes because they're not in UK sizes, but it's a 10 US, 42 EU, a 44 BR, and a 14 AU. So if that helps you, that's what I got it in. So it's a little bit oversized, but still structured and tailored so it doesn't look like you don't look like a box. Um, absolutely love it. Like I said, it's vegan leather, so it's so good. Basically... I realized that I am going to stay here for a little bit of winter. Normally, I'm kind of somewhere that's not cold. Um, but I wanted to give in some more darker colors, more neutrals and stuff. Because you guys know my, my wardrobe is very like youthful and pretty colorful. So I wanted an, a black blazer. But I didn't want it to be a very formal, traditional black blazer. So I picked this up. It's a little bit more trendy. Um, it's a little bit more exciting. A little bit more casual, I would say, as well. Um, but really, really, really cool. I've worn this already on a quite like a lot of different occasions. Like I've worn it out to dinner, but I've also worn it out to like drinks and we went to a club, like everything. So 
um, definitely it's very versatile. Layering this, because it's such a different and unique texture and look to it, layering it looks so, so cool. I would definitely wear this with the flared pants and like the black hat. I think that that looks really cool. Um, it's a nice thing to just throw over your outfit. You'll look so put together, so stylish, on trend, expensive. If you can find this, definitely pick it up. It also came in like a brown sort of color, almost like a camel brown. Um, but I found, found that the black is a lot more versatile, just a lot safer to go with. And I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this. This can also be worn in the spring. It can be worn in the summer because like I said, it's a lot more casual. Um, it can be thrown over a cute little dress and worn with boots and a beanie and stuff. So I would highly, highly recommend this. I love it so much. Like, <laughs> Literally, like I said, I love it so much that if there was a fire, this is what I would take. Like that really says something. So that is everything that I have to share with you guys today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you go and pick up any of these things in store or online. Don't forget that shopping on Cotton On online is amazing. The service is incredible. You can still return and exchange in store. You can get it shipped to your nearest store and pay zero for shipping. Um, so yeah, I would highly, highly recommend um, looking online because that's obviously where you can get stuff from Ruby, from Cotton On Body, and from Factory, and Cotton On all on one platform. So definitely go and check them out. Buy yourself some cute things for the winter season. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Kate Harty and follow me on TikTok at Caitlin Harty. You'll see me styling all these pieces all season long. Don't forget to like this video if you did and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Peace.